Uh, we're building the Tom Patterson Theater for Stratford Festival. Um, this is one of their iconic theaters. It's a Shakespearean theater, a little different than the other theaters they have. It's more of an arena type layout versus the, uh, the stage at the front and all the seating behind. We're building a brand new 4,000 square meter, two story, 650 seats, uh, iconic theater for them. All over North America, people will be coming here. This is to take on uh, Chicago and other play type uh, towns that have a good tourist draw, they want to be the best of the best. So Stratford Festival started out by hiring the correct architect. They've uh, gone with Hariri Contarini, who has gotten fabulous buildings all over the world. And they've designed a, a beautiful, extraordinary building that will be the jewel of, of uh, Stratford Festival when we're done. We have no choice but to get this job done on time and on budget because everybody's watching us all across the country. We've got uh, wood flooring coming from Italy. We've got brick coming from Denmark. We've got uh, an extremely unique curtain wall system that is basically made of bronze mullions and 22 foot high pieces of glass. There's curved glass out of uh, Italy and Spain because they're the only place that could do glass of this size that's curved. Scheduling those unique finishes is a bit more challenging. Glass coming from overseas has to come by boat. Not by boat you're looking at uh, you know anywhere from two weeks to, to four months for things to come over depending on what it is exactly right. We're in contact with our suppliers as, as often as we can to try and understand where things are at. For this curtain wall system especially construction sciences has been a big help. Uh, it's, it's pretty unique. They've been able to sort of point out some concerns that we have in the design early on during the shop drying phase to allow for some adjustments to be made uh, to build our confidence in the quality of the, the material that we're installing in this building. So uh, it helps us uh, you know, move forward with less risk of callbacks knowing that, that we've had a, a second set of eyes on this uh, in extreme detail to make sure that uh, at the end, it's a, it's a good system. In the basement, we have very tight uh, spaces for all our mechanical and electrical systems coming out of the mechanical room down curved hallways. We uh, use, utilize the BIM and the VDC department to take control of the design, take control of the 3D model, work with our subcontractors, figure out exactly how to get every system through the building before we even put a pipe in. All of our in-house services have helped me sleep at night by backing up all of our decisions and making sure we're doing the right thing on site. I'm excited to, to drive by this and, and have this one on my resume. Um, I'm also looking forward to coming here to check out a play once it's open. <laughs>